Hi there. Welcome. This is Shalo from Spooks. Um, the uh, two-link shortening service um, has been updated. It's got an IP uh, and it's got uh, some new statistics programs that they're working on. Uh, and I thought I'd give you a quick preview on, uh, especially those statistics, because there's a really neat uh, statistics uh, that they're building there. I think they're halfway through building it, but uh, it looks promising, and it's all free. So um, if you go have a look at the website, there's already a news item saying that they're working on it. So let's uh, drop into it right away. So if you go into uh, the uh, two link uh, area, <coughs> this is the basic area. It's plain and simple, and that's why I love it. Uh, click in the URL, click shorten, and you have a new shortened URL. Click the show shortened URL manager, and it gives you a really quick and plain pre uh, list of, of all the links that you've created. Um, scroll down and I'll see the latest link that I've created here now um, created on the 26th of January in the morning it's got 23 hits and the last visit by someone was the 1st of February um, now going into the new statistics area just click the link and it'll bring you in it so this is how it's look how it looks right now um, it's probably going to change a bit uh, here and there. Nevertheless, um, so we have um, uh, the link here, short link that you can use in Twitter or whatever. Um, this is the QR code with this link inside it. So, if you have a, a planning on a, a campaign uh, using QR codes, um, just create a link and save down your uh, QR code here. Right cl mouse click and, and save as. Um, use it in your campaigns, uh, advertising, or whatever. And everybody who uses that QR code will be listed here, and you can find all the details for that here. Um, so that's that's you know, starting a QR code, code campaign, you always want to know who's doing what with it, and if it's and how it's used, and which countries are using it. So now, new features that uh, have been added here is that you can add a, um, a project name to a link, a description, and some tags. So this is a project for the 2LK forum, and it's about the uh, um, 2LK development here, um, and some tags. And basically, if you have created keys and you want to add, this will say uh, uh, at default not available, just, just click the edit button, edit it, and press the, uh, the green button, and, you, and, and it saves it out for you. So, so you can add tags. And later on, when the search error, um, uh, modules is finished and uh, from what I've gathered it's going to be a couple of days and then it's finished you can just search you know if you have created a lot of to link uh, um, shortened uh, URLs um, just search for a tag and you'll find all the um, tags with new in it um, or whatever you or whatever the tags that, that, that you've uh, put in there um, then if you scroll down a bit you get a summary detail so if you click on here you'll see that 26% uh, comes out of Seattle by 5 hits Mountain View, those, basically those top two are Google bots two are unknown uh, one from Osterhout, Woodland, Houston, whatever um, and so you have it for the country as well uh, just some basic statistics and the visitors the IPs for them now there's also a save button here, if you click that it'll save that pie chart but it'll save it as a PNG but it'll save it um, um, I think it's a resolution of 1600 pixels wide so you'll have a pie chart that you can use in your um, presentations or whatever also good to notice is that here is going to be an export button somewhere and it'll export all the details gathered for this link because you know it's it's nice that it looks fancy and that you can see okay so how many you know what is a popular city that's visiting me or using the link or whatever country uh, that's all good and nice but basically if you're running a campaign being at a QR code campaign or whatever bottom line is you want to have the statistics in your um, you know database or whatever you're using Excel or to compare it to other numbers and um, use it for presentations and stuff so this is all nice this GUI but Nevertheless, you want to have those uh, numbers, so that's going to be uh, that's going to be in there. 
but um, the uh, API has already been built so the API you know you, you can use that to uh, shorten the URLs from your own website or your own uh, uh, scripting program or whatever so you don't have to visit the TOK website to do that um, they're already uh, built into the, that API already is the export function so um, the export function is going to be uh, added really soon because it's basically done already if you scroll down a bit more then you have a details tab here and if you click that you have all the details gathered for this link and as you can see not many refers but uh, I know that this shortened URL has been used in Twitter and a lot of people use Twitter um, you know with Twitter programs specifically either on their phone or on their uh, um, um, uh, on their PC and not many um, um, so there's not many refers because it's a direct link but nevertheless, you have some uh, uh, interesting uh, statistics here. And if you say, okay, um, United Kingdom Reading, where where is Reading? Just click on the uh, just click on the IP address, and it'll show you a uh, a new screen that will uh, give you a Google map. And uh, just scroll down here, and you'll have Reading. See, so again, that's that's kind of I think that's kind of a neat feature and some some information on top as well. So um, I think that's a really oh no I think I've forgotten to show you something. Uh, basically, if you click on a uh, on the link, uh, it will drop you here, right? Um, but on the top here, it's back to the URL manager, which brings you brings you to a new URL manager, and this one gives you a, a quick overview of your uh, create shortened uh, to link uh, URLs. So in this case, I've created 116. These are your top five hits. So K4 has a five and two hits, blah blah blah. And if you click on uh, one of those keys, it'll bring you back to, or it bring you back to the detail manager, and it gives you more information on. Uh, you can have a look at the, uh, the detailed information or export it. Um, here also on this screen, on the kind of the manager itself, is going to be an export function. And if you click that one, it'll export everything collected of your 116 shortened to OK. URLs, so that's going to be uh, 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 everything. Uh, that's going to be handy as well. So your top five countries, top five OSs, top five refers, um, and the top five hits. Keep in mind that if you shortened a URL like in November or, or September last year, all those details uh, statistics are not available yet. Uh, we've been gathering them for uh, one and a half weeks now, so. Um, We've only have basically if you start a new shortened to OK link, you'll it'll get all the statistics for you. And down here you can just go and um, it'll show you the key and if there's a project name, it'll put the project name behind it. And as you can see, a lot of them don't have a project name yet. So if I click on this one, uh, it says project not available, not available, not available. It hits one, so it's not a it's not a very good. Uh, and then, then I think that this link has never been used. So this has been uh, a, a quick, quick preview of uh, the new statistics program for Two Link. This is all free, so you know, go into the uh, Two LK website. Um, just type in Two LK dot um, and what I'll do here is I'll quick, quickly log out. And if you type Two uh, LK dot in your browser, it'll basically you to this page, part of the ECTCP transfer project. A quick overview of what it's doing, and either click here, register today. Uh, well, actually, this is uh, this is uh, in Dutch, so I'll make it in English. Um, register today, or click on the two link sign up, and register yourself to the ECTCP TCP transfer website. And if you then click on this tab up here, it will not bring you to this page but it'll bring you directly into the shortened uh, URL manager. Alright, so I uh, hope you've enjoyed this. Um, um, you keep keep looking at uh, 2LK because uh, there's a lot of changes going on and again it's all free so if you're a marketing guru or whatever and you're planning on some uh, campaigns this uh, this might be a good option for you.